Part of rearranging is first making a totally chaotic mess. <laughs> <laughs> knock, knock. I'm Mr. Kate. I'm here. I'll take a look at your place. Oh, hi. I'll drop by for a while. Mr. Kate. I'll help you find your style. Mr. Kate. We'll laugh. We'll paint. I'm Mr. Kate. Yay! Hey guys, Mr. Kate here. I am in my actual office space because. I really want to redesign it and finding that there are ways that I want to reorganize and also infuse some more design. That's what I'm going to do and I want you to come along on the journey with me. Right now we're in the main room where most of the jewelry stuff happens. There's also a kitchen in here, which is where we sometimes eat lunch. So we're moving everything around, it's chaotic, but I am going to stain this table. Joey kindly sanded the top. And now I'm gonna stain it with a aged oak Stain. It's gonna look earthy and kind of worn in and then we'll be able to use it to take pictures on and work on it. Multi-purpose surface. I got this at the flea market. It is a runner because we have this hallway connecting the two rooms and runners are one of the easiest ways to add something to a hallway without taking up space. So now we're in the back room of our office space. This is a sort of odd room because it's long and narrow. This is where Joey and I usually work on that table. We have company meetings here, and we got the couch in here, so when we have meetings, we bring the chairs over. And we've got the whiteboard wall, which is really fun. So I have this big frame that I actually found on the side of the road. I'm gonna spray this with a clear coat of like poly spray, just a clear spray paint to seal it. I wanna hang it on this wall, because this is our whiteboard wall, which we painted, and we've been loving, but I kinda wanna jazz it up a bit, and I love the idea of hanging a frame on a whiteboard wall so I can write on the inside of the frame. In addition, I'm gonna hang these lac, Ikea shelves, which are just these really simple floating shelves. They're and that way I can display some of my flea market finds. As you can see, we have a lot of frames because we have a lot of wall space and I definitely want to decorate using images from our jewelry lookbooks. The ones that I spray painted, I spray painted to fit in with my old color scheme. So now we are out in the back patio area. As you can see, really nothing much going on. We usually use it to spray paint in, but I think it'll be a fun place to hang out in. The Mr. Kate workshop redesign is complete. This is our main area. This is where our little kitchenette is and where our big table is because I like to have a communal workspace so we all get to sit together at one big table and he sanded that down, refinished it, stained it with a beautiful natural wood color because I love natural wood tones. The desk chairs, I didn't have a budget to get new chairs so I got inexpensive faux sheepskins from Ikea and covered the chairs so that they look like new chairs but they're the same old chairs. And then of course, the the workshop is also about the Mr. Kate jewelry line, so we had to display that in full regalia on the mantelpiece and in the little cubby holes. And then we accented everywhere with framed photos from our different lookbook shoots because it's inspiring to work around the art that you've already created. In the hallway, I put down that colorful rug. I used my DIY spoon painting because it was a nice big canvas. So now we've got color. This is our new, we're calling it the conference room slash photo shoot room where we have the white psych. So we can take outfit photos or whatever we wanna do. And then on the other end of the room by our beautiful windows that are leading out to our outdoor patio, we have this round table which used to be in my kitchen and is now here because it was actually too big for our kitchen area. And it's where we can sit and have meetings or conference calls and just be away from the main area of the office if we want some privacy or quiet time. And then on the wall, we have these wonderful floating shelves, which are now holding all of our vintage and flea market finds. And then this radical gold frame that is hung kind of crooked on the wall because I just love that. And of course, it's still our whiteboard wall so I can write in the middle of the frame and probably you'll see that in some future videos. I love having an outdoor space now. This area was pretty much just dead space. We used to just spray paint in it. And now it's covered with this patio cover that I've had in my closet for a while. It's now shading this area and then with an outdoor rug and some patio furniture and our DIY palette 
coffee table. And then this side table is really cool. It's actually a tree stump that I snaked from some tree trimmers that were cutting down a tree. And some plants add so much life and greenery to the space. And oh, <laughs> a bowl of vending machine mustaches. All right, that ends the tour of our Mr. Kate workshop redesign project. I hope you guys got inspired and maybe some tips that you can use in your own spaces. Thanks for watching. Yeah.